uh, Quentin got a little bit active in the beginning of the show yesterday. And so uh, let's do a little bit of a quick recap of yesterday. So mm-hmm. To it, quit, Quentin. Um, I'm going to mm-hmm. start with you. What are your Slice thoughts cook. on tonight's show? I'm going to tell you right now. I'm going to get it together. but yeah. I, I, I think... I think someone needs to get Q in check because she automatically, the first thing that comes out of my house is for her to tell me I'm wrong. <laughs> what do you mean somebody got to get her in check? That's, that, you get her in check. Somebody, hey, like you wrong, nigga, type shit. Because it, it happened last week, too, when she said Phoenix wasn't on the West Coast. The fuck is this kind of bullshit? No, that ain't <laughs> what we talking about as far as the show last night. Last night was crazy. Well, last night, she couldn't wrap her mind around the fact that it was triple the damn price. <laughs> Quinn, you was active, hey. though. You you were saying that uh, people... You was, you was cooking early. Early. Quinn was active last night. What do you, what did it, What does the audience think about what Quinn was... Did you catch the show yesterday, Slimmy? Any of it? I, I, caught, I, caught, uh, I caught a lot of it. You know what I'm saying? I was mostly listening to it. Mm-hmm. Uh, um, I called Quentin cooking early, and then the rest of it. I'm gonna be honest, man. It was just more. It was just Jamisha really getting cooked and just agreeing to get cooked. Like it was. What do you mean by was, agreeing to get cooked? <laughs> agreeing to get cooked because she kept challenging. I, I she volunteer kept challenging tribute. Folks. She kept challenging folks, but it was just like she didn't really have an argument every time. It was just like, she was just going at people with what they were saying. Like she was just making it immediately. She was just going against the grain immediately. I like like really letting people. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't get me wrong. She's great for content creation because she not letting no, she's not leaving no stone unturned period. She's going to make you know what the fuck you talking about when you dealing with her, you gotta know or she's going to keep going at you until you're wrong. Mm-hmm. But if you're you not are. wrong in the she fact that she wants you to pre- to cite your sources in the middle of a conversation is wild to me. That ain't normal. To that's cite your source. Well, I mean, that's put a link in the like that. That's, that's her. That's her. That's her. I, I read a book two, two years ago. What you mean? I'm not putting a link in the in the fucking back. <laughs> like some shit, you just know it. You read it. You know it. You put it in your fucking brain, and you just know. Why the fuck I gotta send you a link for? Why do no, why I do y'all work th- like that for some people? Why do y'all why do y'all think that um people don't like her so much? I thought that the majority of the black a majority of black people actually had her mindset. So it's kind of surprising to me that they do. So why is this it is so like, this is the suburbs? You gotta realize your channel is the suburbs. You think so? The, people, the people's channel that we was talking in the background, that's the ghetto. <laughs> So the people that we we got like minded people, you got a little sprinkle, little sprinkle people that don't want to capitulate and um get on board with the rest of us. But for the most part, we don't deal with them yuckas that just like to argue, and she just fucking argue. Well, I she think she's bad, but she's, she's arguing, arguing in favor. Bad faith. She's arguing in favor of what the culture, majority of the culture, thinks. Right. So when you really start to put it in perspective. I'm kind of surprised that more people don't agree with her. Um, be- or, or it could be that people, maybe black people are starting to wake up and less and less, less and less people. No, no. They, you don't they, think no, they, like, no, they rock with her. It's just that she yells. Like they don't, they don't agree with the delivery. If she gave it more yeah. like calm and collected, they'd probably be like, okay, I see it. But she'd just be yelling and they'd be like, fuck you. I don't even think they hear what she's saying because she's yelling. Mm. No, no, it's, it's very masculine. You know what I'm saying? So that, so, so, it's gonna be received completely differently. She, she even like, she more, like, she more harsh. She more harsh with it than jazz. You know, jazz. Because I can see this, like, to it. I, I can tell you this. Like when she's talking, like I can see, like she one thousand percent coming from a good place. Like she's empathetic. She has grace for the people and what people go through. I Who? get it. You talking about Jamisha or jazz? Yeah, yeah, Jamisha. She, she, okay. like, I get really it, do, like, she fucking feels that shit in her heart. But no, I think Jasmine's a little bit more blackity black than Jamisha is. Like, you can't tell fucking Jasmine shit about black people. <laughs> Jamisha, I mean, will listen. Jamisha will listen and be like, okay, I get it. Yeah, they're fucked up. But Jasmine, there ain't nope. 
You better not say not near nothing about it. All right, so let me let me play a little bit of it. Let's see, let's get into it. Let's see if I can get to some other parts that may have been a little bit interesting. Um, right. Check for check up here. She's gonna, she gonna be a, she gonna, until until she get her nursing degree. She's gonna, be, she's gonna be a fucking dental assistant. Who she talking gonna to? She's gonna become a travel nurse, and she's gonna drive a Nissan Altima, and then she's gonna be saying, "Hey, she's gonna be going to brunch." Every other weekend, she going to brunch. She's saying, hey, she's probably going to move to Atlanta. <laughs> right? Oh, man. Atlanta, Atlanta, Houston. Okay. All right. Because they saying that Texas is lower. So they fucked up Atlanta. They're going to go to Houston. Okay. And so these, these are the people that's a part of y'all community. I see them every single day. Every day. They had the, all of the hot spots. They never got nothing to do. They if always complain. Hear, they fucking weed. Them, well, they always got a lace right? point that sit right here. All of them got a lace front and shit right fucking here. None of them. So, so I kind of went ham last night. I went yeah. into I went into dark dark mode and time. Um, you know, I started cracking a couple jokes here and there, or whatever, so on and so forth. But she never stood. She never really stood down. I never. I never. You know what I've noticed? I've noticed that over a period of time. If women keep coming back and they keep on, you know, going back and forth from me or whatever, I think eventually they start to give in to my way of thinking. Yeah. Like, I've seen jazz evolve. Jazz has evolved. Maybe, you know, she not she not too much different. Thank you, the Viral Syndicate. I'm going to read that Super Chat shortly. She not too much different. But jazz has evolved significantly to where she even surprised me the last show when she kind of took a position – that was more aligned with how we think. And so I, I think that Jamisha, I think she might be on that same path. She just kind of resisting, bro. I, I think, think she's like a baby that tires themselves out fussing and fighting and she go hard so hard she got to take a breath. Cause she like, she came out like was like hot. Then she like took off in the middle of the conversation. Then at the back end, she was like back at it again. <laughs> well, because tired. because she's been conditioned to think that way her whole life, so it's not going to be one or two shows that's going to convince. And I'm not saying that you ever going to really convince her, but what I am saying is that it seems like you know the the I don't know, man. I think that I I have to I got to kind of congratulate her and kind of standing on business and doing what she's doing because to be able to stand up to that type of heat and still endure. That's that's pretty uh I think it's pretty commendable, I guess. I don't know what you would say. Yeah, that's why I say well she she she's willingly taking L's. You know, she doing this shit like she she holding her position. She's not backing down, but at the same time, she's still standing and dying on a hill. You know what I'm saying? She 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 be even if you listen to her, sometimes she's admitting that, okay, yeah, you got me. You know, she's admitting that, but she's still going full throttle, you know, somebody, which is, I mean, I guess you could say that is commendable, but at the same time, sometimes you just, sometimes you should just fall back. Somebody said, what's wrong with a Nissan? Ain't not, all right, so listen, nothing is wrong with a Nissan Altima, all right? <laughs> that, that is, that it's is just, just a, it's just a joke. I used to tell, <laughs> I used to tell Lucky she looked like she drove a Nissan Altima. <laughs> Wow. You know, it's like oh, that yeah, girl from like around that. the way. She kind of cute. She got like a middle of the road job. She kind of making it. She light skinned it. Nissan Altima. <laughs> <laughs> it's not just for the people in the chat. There's nothing wrong with a Nissan Altima. It's, it's just <laughs> it's just the joke. It's almost like a Nissan Altima for women is almost like a Hellcat for for uh -huh. guys. You know what I'm saying? So no. Hellcat, you gotta have some money. Nissan now tomorrow, you just no, you don't. Like a, These dudes oh, put yeah, dudes you just need a five fifty credit score and a hundred dollar down payment to get a no, Nissan also. <laughs> dude, these dudes, they will be living in the most squalor of conditions. And as long as they got a car, a Hellcat, they good. They will pay <laughs> making all that percent interest. God dang noise! Telling you, they will pay twenty three percent interest, and it doesn't matter as long as they got a car. They they could be parking in in in. They could be living literally behind a dumpster and sleeping at the job and sleeping in their car. But as long as they got it, they feel like they're good. 
Man, I was kind of mad when I got my first car and then nobody helped me. I was the I was the only um person of my siblings that didn't get help getting their first car and I was kind of I was kind of Oh, we didn't have that privilege. My dad made us made us buy our own car. Oh. Well, my dad co my dad co-signed for my brother's first car and then my sister and my grandpa gave her the car. Mm-mm. My first car, my ass took my ass to the bank and got hit over the head with 18% interest. <laughs> But but see, we didn't ha- we didn't we couldn't do that. Like we had to buy our car cash. Like we had to work, save up, and then go. Like my first car, I bought my first car in I think it was two thousand ninety nine two thousand. I bought a nineteen eighty six Buick Regal. Oh shit! Woo! Yep, I bought a nineteen eighty six Buick y'all, Regal. Y'all gonna, y'all, gonna, y'all gonna judge me when I tell you on my first car. Two thousand and one Mitsubishi Eclipse. <laughs> See, you was you was blessed. You was blessed. You you got it. You got it better than us. Yeah, but we had wow. to we had to go and we had to go and grind and get ours. Let me see if I can find this one spot in the, in the degrees show. to get good. I make over money. one. But I was intentional. So what I did was don't blame them. Let me see. Let me see if I can find them. Oh, no, it's further down. Hold on. Yeah, yeah no, this, no, age, this is to me. I spent the amount of money that I paid. Pay. What's your parents' fault? Is your fault? Oh, let me see if I can find it. I'm, 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 I'm a looking for a certain part. I have. So your parents didn't help you. You don't have a better chance to get in. I'm trying to look for a certain part where you talking. Talking college if you got a 2.0 GPA. I don't understand why we why why, why we don't embrace community college too. But the beauty supply store they got a big community college. Libraries is getting shut down because they ain't getting no fucking funding and niggas want to burn books. But I digress. Now, y'all find money for the shit that, the shit that y'all want to. Y'all out here going, as y'all was out, as y'all everybody do. in fucking Atlanta and in the blackest cities so ain't got no jobs. Your tax the credit. freeways That's be fucking excuse. full. The That's freeways be full in the daytime. What you everybody everybody want to just play games and ain't nobody taking responsibility. Y'all continue to have children out of wedlock. Y'all keep asking for more money for the earned child tax credit. That's why y'all keep having all of these Who fucking kids that? out of wedlock. Y'all that? keep on being on social services and taking all the tax back? money. Why we got to ask for our money Y'all out here for ask for our money back? And keeping y'all kids from y'all baby daddies, which basically is the real generation. I don't believe in that shit. That's and, right. And, and, and the fact of the matter is, when somebody finally call y'all out on y'all bullshit and say that ain't nobody feeling no excuses for you because you're doing the same thing that your parents did that you know you're not supposed to be doing, nobody want to be honest and, and take responsibility for it. It's always the system's fault. It's always the culture's fault. It's always the parents' the fault. It's always somebody else's part. fault. I have the never seen anybody, nobody, no woman, no woman that is voting for Kamala Harris has ever came to the front of the congregation and say, they I fucked drop my own Guns life. off in the, in the community, none of that happened, right? All of that shit is a conspiracy. No, that's you, that's y'all. You know who the killers are in your own community. You know who the dealers are. You know what's everything. And y'all continue. You Not only are y'all supporting them, y'all harboring them and y'all sleeping with them too. Ooh. I don't know who he talking to, but he. Mm. Y'all, you and your sisters. Ne- what What do you think about the conversation in the beginning? It almost like the beginning of the show set the tone for the whole show. Yeah. And when I when I sign on, I honestly I don't be thinking about nothing. Like I don't anticipate nothing. I'm not sure what's gonna happen. None of that stuff. I just be like, yo, I wonder what's gonna happen tonight. I pop on, I see who on there, and I'm like, okay, well, we're gonna see what's happening. Last week when I first got on, I didn't know what to expect. And then it was like three verse one, four, four, four verse, uh, four <laughs> verses one. This time I got on there and I was just like, eh, it might be a little bit more chill, and then it just went ham. Uh, this time it seems like everybody was against Jamisha, and maybe, maybe even no, because Khalil was he was kind of like against her too. But it seemed like she was she was kind of like on the island by herself. I think maybe homie in the uh, bottom left corner. I didn't really hear him that much. Maybe he got her back. I don't know. No, he didn't. But, no, he didn't. Oh, he didn't. Okay, nope. so she was dying on the hill by herself. She was but by the herself. Thing is, but the thing is. She didn't care. She didn't care. She was just 
she was just gonna go. And I think what kind of fueled her was she felt like she had to go by herself and she had to stand on all 10 because she was by herself. She was solo. I don't know. But yeah, I know I would, she was getting I would like hooked. to for people that got a difference of opinion. I don't want to go get people that just automatically want to. One thing I hated, uh, I used to hate on that other channel is that they would bring their friends and stuff on there and their friends was already plotting and planning to go against me. Like they was already trying. Mm. It was like a setup. I want people that have differences of opinion, but not people that's looking to go at me per se, because it's almost like that became the show to see how it was that they could try to go at me or people that's cowards because they don't disagree. It's not about disagreeing or agreeing. It's just about having a, a you know, a whole lot of different people with a whole lot of different, you know, mindsets towards the different subjects that we talk about. And so that's the balance. I think that we got it, that we trying to figure out is, you know, how can you get the right people? but not people with a bad intention from the get-go, from the start. You know what I'm saying? That's Because I want it to be organic. I don't want it to be like, oh, man, I'm coming to get you in time. Because that's stupid because you're not arguing the point. You're arguing against me, and that's the difference. And it's really about the debate, not about people, not about specific people. It's about proving your point and substantiating your argument. It's not about yeah. going at a specific it's, person. It's, it's, it's pretty, not going to make it fun. It is tripped out, but... Yeah, Monday nights, it's... It's, uh, it, it, it wears me thin. When there's a loudmouth woman just going ham, I'll just be like... I, 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 I'll be wanting to log off. <laughs> like, no, man, no, 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 no. I don't, I don't, I don't care, care if it's a woman. You don't understand how peaceful it is in the confines of my space. Well, I do this all day, every day, so I'm I'm automatically um, engaged you with what's going on. You got a button, you push the button, you tune it out. Let me play a little bit more of this. Ever, not not you know, I. This is just a part of the system. Go, y'all want to see y'all sleeping and harboring future. Every time they catch a black person, don't do that, Queens. Food. Don't be harboring every you know, time. Do every that. time they catch a black dude that's on a run from the police that got his dread shaking, he always holds up in some woman's house. Oh, one of y'all's houses. That's terrible. And all of y'all decide that y'all want to be. No, no, no. And then, and then let, me, let me give you. Let, let me give you the let me give you the black community woman single baby mama starter kit. All right. So oh then she, then, then she, then she gonna get her then she gonna get her life together and she's gonna become a nurse. <laughs> <laughs> she, she gonna go into nursing, y'all. So now and people she, in the medical field. Look, <laughs> she gonna okay. be a travel nurse. She gonna be a travel nurse. She gonna be a Nissan Altima, It's only funny because right? it's true. <laughs> It's funny that y'all laugh. Wow, Eighteen percent like interest in Santander. A lot of like y'all check for check up here. She's gonna, she gonna be a, she gonna, until until she get her nursing degree. Crazy. She's gonna, be, she gonna be a fucking dental assistant. She Who's she talking she gonna to? A, she's gonna become a travel nurse, and she's gonna drive a Nissan Altima, and then she's gonna be saying, "Hey, she's gonna be going to brunch." Every other weekend, she going to brunch. She's saying, hey, she's probably going to move to Atlanta. Right. Oh, man. And back on Houston. Okay. All right. Because they saying that Texas is lower. So they fucked up Atlanta. They're going to go to Houston. Okay. And so these, these are the people that's a part of y'all community. I see them every single day. Every day. They at the, all of the hot spots. They never got nothing to do. They if always complain. Hear, they fucking weed. Them, well, they they always got a lace them. front that sit right here. All of them got a lace front that sit right fucking here. None of them wear their own hair, and they always complain the about what they're doing. So and now these the same up. And, I, and I'm gonna just say this, Quentin, you the one that influenced me to say Middle Park bust down. But I know. <laughs> <laughs> let me. I'm gonna keep playing this. Let me let this play through. Motherfuckers, you watch porn and beat your dick to that you talking about with the weaves right I'll be here. My dick to <laughs> y'all beat be y'all dick, dick to them girls, please. You love a single mama with some kids. That's, that's what that's it your is. Y'all be out the shit that you be fucking going. I wouldn't. Hard I wouldn't be caught dead with these. Please, this shit is hilarious to me. <laughs> I wouldn't be caught dead with a middle part bust down hoe at all. <laughs> middle part bust down hoe. Good God Almighty. That's that's what they are. Listen, listen, listen. 
I wouldn't be caught around a middle part oh. bust down in any capacity mm. in my That's life. Crazy. <laughs> and and you know what the worst part about it is? So I was at Afro Nation this weekend, right? Both days, both days. Mm. And they always trying to get into the VIP area. Ain't none of them got no money. They got $20 to their name. They always trying to come into the VIP. I was telling secure, I said, hey, keep that one out because that one is big. And they always fucking weigh 280. 280 with a skinny friend trying to get into the VIP area. Middle, middle fucking part bust down. Uh, they all got their stomachs out and it's rolls on rolls on rolls on rolls on like they did. <laughs> 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 Why? Uh, you know what, dog? I don't even know how I come up with what it is that I come up with. I just be talking, man, and I just be saying stuff and it just be real. Because I be telling, the, I be actually giving um, real, <laughs> real it's true. Real insight as to what I'm be seeing. So the reason why, listen, the reason why the jokes hit is because it be true, and it's really what mm -hmm. I'm seeing in real life, and that's what I'm be saying. Well, let me play a little bit more, and then we gonna finish this up. Everybody hey, know that shit. Fucking a man, dancing hard, sweating, <laughs> musty, this and going to get real. into that, and then they go, and then listen, listen, and so now you, just, you see them walk out, you see them walk here. out. Great. They go and get into their Nissan Altima, <laughs> and the Altima ain't got no fucking bumper. And I look at it, and it's like the, all, the car looked like no, no, no. Listen, the car looked like this. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Take that this shit is down, bro. Ass wrong, man. What the fuck are we looking at right now? <laughs> this nigga dead, bro. Yeah. Wrong. Oh, oh, wait, no, no. Hold on, no. Wait. What even, like, caused this, though? Look at the, hold on, but look at, watch the reaction when I say it. Hold on, watch this. I'm going to rewind it five seconds. Watch this. The, off, the car looked like, no, 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 listen. The car looked like this. <laughs> <laughs> look at the do rag in it. Look at Cam. He can't hit the head. Yeah, boy, the do rag toast. <laughs> and Molly, and Molly. Everybody put their head told, down. Oh, girl, everybody gone. <laughs> Molly, she put her head down. Everybody gone. <laughs> everybody gone. <laughs> <laughs> I don't I don't even know why I said that. Man, what is going on? I don't know. I don't know why I did that. I don't know why I said cuz cuz if you look at the front bumper, if you look at a car with no bumper on it, it looks like that. It looks like <laughs> looks like they want the bottom oh, <laughs> <man. laughs> Oh. Why? Oh my <laughs> god, dog. If you've ever look, the next time that y'all see a car with no bumper on, you're not gonna be able to unsee that shit, bro. I promise. No, bro, I already know what it is. <laughs> I be thinking the same thing. I'm like, yo, what is up? And that shit the strangest shit ever, bro. Oh. Had, like, you just see that car parked there, like the rest of that body. Dog, I'm crazy, telling you, man. man. I'm telling you, bro. My first, my first merch, my first merch drop is gonna be. <laughs> it's gonna be a Nissan Altima with no bumper on it, bro. <laughs> <laughs> the The first picture that I have is gonna be a Nissan Altima with no no bumper, and on the back of the shirt, it's gonna say. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> this is out of control. I'm about to pull it up. I'm about to pull it up, Quinn. Out of control. That is, that's what it looks like. <laughs> <laughs> now look, look, look at the picture. Watch this. Look at the picture, and look at this shit. Tell me that that's not the same fucking thing. <laughs> It's the same. 
That's the same picture, bro. Oh, it's the same God. picture, bro. Real that talk, man. Man, this shit should not be that like that, man. Dog, it's oh, just life. It's just, that's just real life. That's what really what it was. So I don't know, man. Last night was wild. Um <laughs> It ain't got no sense, bro. You would think that after all <laughs> this time. Uh, I don't know, bro. I don't know, man. It's a crazy time. It's a crazy time to be alive, man. Insane yes, time to be alive. So I hope everybody enjoys the shows. Uh, <laughs> I hope y'all be enjoying um, Monday night. Monday, Monday. Is is way better than the old Thursdays. I'll tell you that much. Uh oh. No, no, no. That's a. Fa- that, I'm not dissing. That's just a fact. Like, we do better numbers. We have better entertainment. It's better conversations. It's more broad all across the board. It's just ten times better. We've already we've already beat the shit. We proved that a long time ago. So. I think because Mondays I, I, I is think the, because it's Mondays is yeah, the. Number. I think. I think because it's more of a reaction show than just like. Uh, talking point based, you know what I'm saying? Like that was kind of like, it was really more like battle of the sexes type shit. More than anything, most most nights that I saw it. Yeah. And this is more like it's it it be all over the place. You know what I'm saying? It, it, the conversations can go everywhere, mm. everywhere. Yeah. You know, so it hit harder. <clears throat> So yeah, I don't way hard. it's weird. It's weird. But any final thoughts on that? I'll just meet you back next week. <laughs> I think that people are still like, week, and you that. Jazz is there Someone too. hit me in the DM and said, Will you ha- have Q have her back next week? And I said, No. Well, Q have no, her back man. next week. <laughs> Jamisha, not just you don't think no. she's gonna come back? Yeah, she's coming back. I, I think she, she will. I'm back. just not asking. <laughs> I don't know. Coming I think she back. she should be able to be back. I don't see why she wouldn't come back. I like peace. I, I, hope I like peace. And jazz. I never I never realized how peaceful it is in my home until I go to someone else's home or I hear a loud mouth heffa yelling through my computer speakers. Damn. <laughs> I don't know, man. Listen, if you you you'd be surprised, bro. These are people that that argue all the time. I think the day that they she comfortable. I don't know, man. I mean, people used to think well, that in my in my life when I argue, people shut up. They don't. They just shut up because they know I'm right. They don't fuck to say shit back. <laughs> I think she'll be back. I mean, and even if she's not, even if she's not know, back, no, she'll come back. I just, I just. She dealt with all of the memes and all of the clipped up clips that she dealt with before that everybody that I made her famous for last week. So I don't see why she wouldn't be back. <clears throat> no, nah, panel with with Jamisha. Sugar and Jazz? No, I'm not doing that. I'm not that doing that. Uh, Jasmine, Jasmine shut up <laughs> when other people start talking. If somebody else is arguing, Jasmine <laughs> shut up. I'm not doing that. That, I'm might, doing that. that might be OD, man. 